So just one more thing about supporting. No, I don't. Don't worry. My rant is finished. Um, I'm glad most of you enjoyed that yesterday. It was really interesting reading your comments about what team you support and why you support them. Fascinating. And that's what I love about it. Some of the random stories about why you support a team. Absolutely brilliant. So thank you for that, guys. Right. Today, we have more signings, a couple of league games and a draw for this little beauty. The champions. Champions League. You can tell from my dulcet tones. Right, roll the intro. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode nine of the Flipped League Save. We spent a bit more money couple of youngsters, um, one I already had my eye on, but also another player that lots of people suggested. So we've done the business. Also, today's Champions League draw, so that's why we've come back this early. But also, it's not been going entirely our way. I did think we were just going to breeze past opponents. Um, but we lost against Lincoln and drew against Wickham. Um, but we did beat Dagenham Redbridge 4-0. So maybe just, you know... Players are getting used to the formation. A loss, a draw, and then destruction. Right, but let's get to the Champions League. Um, what we'll do, I think, is um, we'll do the Champions League draw, and then we'll skip to the first round of the Champions Group stage. Because um, I think the league's going to be... All we'll do one of the games and then skip, because I just want to make sure we're actually winning games, because at the moment, we're eighth. Also, the board expect us nothing less than a win, a Premiership win this season. So we've got to get the business done. We can't have any messing about. I'll just show you the goal scorers. So um, in the 2-1 loss, um, Mr. Boney M scored. And then in the 1-0 um, draw, big Danny Ings. He's not that big. Medium-sized Danny Ings scored a late equaliser. And then we smashed Dagenham and Redbridge. Boney M with a hat-trick and Bailey Cargill, the the young centre-back from Bournemouth, um, with a goal. So 4-0, clean sheet, bish-bash-bosh, job done. Transfers, let's have a look. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -da. We have, oh, only one new player. There's going to be more. So we finally signed Josh Timon, 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 Josh. We've got Josh in the door um, and we've loaned him straight out because I bought... I bought three left backs, <clears throat> but he's uh, been promised first team football at Rochdale, who are League One now. Stuart Pearce is manager, so he should develop nicely. He is their key man. I wanted to get him to a club that was going to play lots of football, get him, get him some game time and all that sort of stuff. Um, we have signed from Leeds. I do have a soft spot for Leeds, especially in managing them in FM16. Fucking love that save. Um, Ronaldo Vieira, a hot prospect that lots of you know about. He's five-star potential. Pretty much every my scouts think everybody's five-star potential at this point. Um, they're just so confused about what the fuck is going on. Uh, we signed him for a cheeky bargain of £1.2 million. He's played two games already, got an assist. He is looking fruity. Um, and then, where's the other guy gone? Did he fuck off to the other plate? What happened to, what happened to the other dude? Hey, what? It's not even in sort of. I can't even remember his name. Shit, what was his name? Hold the line, please. We are trying to connect to your call. Um, he was a central midfielder. He had a he had a funny name. I talked about him in the last episode. There, did he fuck off to somebody else? He went to Wrexham. That's disappointing. To be fair, he wanted almost 30 grand a week, which is a bit nuts. Um, we will... Well, that that's just rude. I didn't even see that happening. Um, can we get a new scout report, please? It's all right. We'll, we'll fuck them over this season. And uh, when do they finish? They did finish fifth in the league, so they got European football. But, mate, mate. My, my scout said that he would ask between 6 and 16 which already is quite a wide margin, but then he asked. He started off asking for thirty-six grand a week. <laughs> Nuts. Um, okay, we'll we'll just pick him up another time then, bastards. All right. Um, Bright is out, but he's only it's only a minor injury. Just, oh, he's ripped his cock off. Hang on. No, he's ripped his cock off. 
Um, it's not going to tell me how long he's out for. Maybe he's not ripped his cock off. He's just going for a massive masturbation session and has booked a couple of weeks off work. You know, we've all done that. We've all done that. Right. Um, I have dropped Dale Fry because his epic defending in the first three games of the season. Truly horrific. 6.3. I should have fined him. 6.3. And a hefty 7. Um, yeah, don't know what happened there. Bailey Cargill came in. Done a job, right? Um, but let's get into it. Right. So Champions League draw, people. I imagine we're fourth fourth pot, aren't we? Oh no, we're, we're winners. So we're first seeds, aren't we? Because it's not done on how good we are. It's done on who won. Woohoo! Top seeds. Real Madrid. Benfica, Moscow, Bayern, Bayern, sorry, I get told off for that, Juventus, Barcelona, Paris Saint-Germain, and Eastley. Hmm, what's the odd one out there? Right, let's have a look. Oh, I, I don't care about doing well in the Champions League this season. Like, I'd like to, but I just want to play some massive teams. Dortmund, please, or Atletico Madrid. Okay, not Atletico Madrid. Okay, Dortmund's still there. Dortmund's still there. It's Dortmund! Yeah! Or, oh, sort of, yeah. Okay, who do we want from this? Celtic? Leon? Roma? Monaco? Bit, uh, no, not Celtic, not Roma, not Leon. Um, Monaco's gone. Okay. I'll go for Anderlecht. Oh, God, fuck, just, all right, fine. Bill Bow. Okay, fine. Um, who do we want here? Feyenoord? I do like them as a club. Copenhagen? Gateshead. <laughs> that just looks weird. Lincoln. <laughs> We've got to get them. Feyenoord's gone. Lincoln. <laughs> I just can't go over it. just looks so weird. Juventus, Shakhtar, Monaco and Gateshead. Um, imagine the scouts of the other teams. They're like frantically Googling Gateshead. What the fuck is this? Right. Okay. Oh, just did draw the last team, just assumed. Victoria Plizen in the Czech Republic. Um, let's have a look at their key man. They're, they're potentially a team we could beat. Um, so I'd be okay with getting into the Europa League, to be honest. Um, I'd be all right with that. <clears throat> yeah, no, yeah, no intentions. Of course, he, of course he's not. No intentions of joy. Will Steele. He doesn't speak English, and yet he's lived in Peterborough. For four years. Have you got learning difficulties, mate? Oh, those bit, oh, no, he does speak. I'm an idiot. I've got the learning difficulties. He he has a full un... Just skim over that bit, people. Just just skim over that. I think we've got a great chance. Mm. Age is no barrier. Um, no, we're not really looking to make any more deals. I'm going to save them. I tried to buy... <laughs> I, <laughs> I tried to buy Fellaini. Just... Purely for the memes, just so I could put me Fellaini wig on and go, Fellaini said that. And and he'd, he'd gone to China last year and he doesn't want to come back or they don't want to sell him. Um, I'm not discussing it. Um, we're playing Tranmere. Oh, gives us a chance. Oh, um, tough. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's. Okay. Right. Walking. We're playing walking. No, we're not loaning any of our players out. Right, right. I've got no idea how this is going to go because I win Jocelyn the Law in the in the last three games. We should be just destroying people, surely. Um, easy win. No, he's our first teamer. Why would we be loading him out? Um, we're the underdogs. He's like, good eye, my dear. My name's Harry Kuehl. Uh We the underdogs. Beauty. That's, that's as good as it gets, people. Right. <clears throat> boo, 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 boo. Right. Just thought of a funny story that I might tell you, but then I might tell you in a in a. I might make a separate video. It's about. Meeting an online woman, well, meeting a woman that I met online um, many, many moons ago, over 20 years ago, when it was unheard of. I might save that. In Australia, I flew to Australia when I was 18 to meet a woman I met online because I'm a crazy, on my own, when I'd never been abroad. It's a fun story. I might make a video about that because it's like story time with Loki. Right, let's play some football. 
Um, I'm surprised how many goals Boney M is scoring because he, I didn't expect, as a Tiger Man support, usually not as many goals. But he's just banging him in, seven in four. He's a crazy man. Um, I actually want the other two guys to get a couple more goals. They're doing all right. I suppose one in two for both of them would be pretty special. Right, we're going for Ronaldo Vieira as the deep line playmaker, Malumbi as the ball winning midfielder, and uh, that's you, you can read. I don't know what I'm telling you. Look, just fucking read it. Pause it if you're that bothered. Right, I believe he's gonna have enough power to see him off woking today. Good, good. Our Wilfred Boney is our key man. Why has the game? Okay, game was just having a little think about it. Okay. Who's this? Tyrese. See, their players are already better. He's 17. He's not a bad player. He definitely didn't come through their youth ranks. Ah, oh, look. Little Man City regen steal. I need to do more of that and steal all their good regens before they get to us. Wow. they got some young players. Are all your players? 21. 23. They're, built, they're, doing, they're doing the same plan as us, guy. Came Ferdinand. 24. He's an oldie. 25. They're just getting one year older every, every time. 22, that is 19, that is a crazy 21, that is a crazy young, that's that's young 20 and 18 year old goalkeeper they've literally just gone and hoovered up every half decent youth player that's quality, right <clears throat> let's get into the game yeah, let's get into serious fucking football shit here people, come on, sort yourselves out right I've got no idea how we're playing. Are we on control? Yes. With my super 5-4-1-ish, I've called this formation. Because, you know, I'm clever like that. It's fluid, yeah. It's fluid. Right. Dings is going to score a brace. I just I just felt it happen because I'm wearing my brain sock. Hadara. Dings, lovely ball in. Ah! Rah, rah, Rasputin. People that don't know about Boney M, because you're not 100 years old, will find that celebration quite weird. They were a band, right? And they had a song called Rasputin, right? Brown girl in the ring, tra-la-la-la-la, it sounds a bit racist now, tra-la-la-la-la-la. But that was the song as well. Quality, quality tunes, my friends. This is what you missed if you're young. Quality music. You think, oh, you're Justin Bieber's and bollocks. Nah. It's all about the Boney M. Right. Boney. Magoma. Can he, is he going to knock it forward? Oh, decent, decent. Trying to pass it into the top, top corner. Right. Okay, we're off. We're off and running. So, you know, if the league gets a bit easy, we will, like I said, just sort of skip forward a little bit and, uh, um, you know, just concentrate on the Champions League this season. But the, the, the conference sides have made some better signings this year. They've worked out. They're probably rolling in money because we've got lots of money and I've spent quite a lot of money. These teams must be just sitting there, the owners, <laughs> with hundreds of millions of pounds. Um, Mr. Mister Boney? Um, okay. I think that was a shot because there was nobody. I don't know if it, what makes it worse. If that was a shot or a pass, either way, got no idea. Oh, it's lovely, though. Hadara cuts, cuts it across. Podium. Go on, son. There's number nine of the season in just the uh, four games. That's a couple of assists already for Hadara, though, so that's nice. I thought he might shoot. That was that sort of angle that they might actually shoot. Also, I know a lot of you were, were scared by the beard loss. I've still got a beard. It's still, it's still there, just a bit shorter. It was getting a bit homeless, so occasionally I'll just like take it right back, you know, um, and then let it get homeless again, probably. But my beard does grow pretty quick. So so don't panic. All right. People said I look younger. Thank you very much. Not a day over 47. Here we go again. He's already on a hat trick. Half an hour in. Dings. Turns. Uh, Hadara. Hadara. OK, that's why you're a wing back. Uh, uh, uh. Right, Nick a third. <clears throat> Do I take Boney off when he's on a hat trick? I kind of feel bad now. Fuck it, I'm heartless. Um, <laughs> end of that conversation. I was like, oh, "Do I? Do I know? Fuck him. It's not about you, mate. It's about the team. Want to give Gallagher some game time? Get him improving because he could be a 
Oh, that's a stamp. Disgusting cane. Not even a yellow card. Um, probably, probably get rid of one of these. Maybe the ball winning midfield on a yellow card. Let's get get him off the pitch because he might be clay. Oh, stop getting yellow cards, people. We're two 0 up. They've not had a shot. Chill out. In fact, I could probably just tell them rather than just shouting at the screen. I can actually um, calm down. If you wonder what's on my hoodie, it's gamers don't die, they respawn. We do indeed. We do indeed. Also, just let you know, if you have ordered a brain sock um, in the last sort of seven, since last Wednesday. Um, oh, tits. Um, since last Wednesday, um, they will be getting posted out probably Friday. I've just been a bit lazy. It's a long walk, man. So selfish. But they, I'll, I'll get them sent out this week. Promise. That's a, that's a good finish, to be fair, from the youngster. Have, have, don't, don't drop points here, boys. I'm not going counter-attacking. That's, no, no. Willock's coming on for Magoma. <clears throat> They've had one shot on target. If they draw this, I'm going to be quite angry. And I shall show my anger with a fist shake. Don't. That's it, Fieldy. Just stamp on the back of his legs. It's fine. Oh, oh, oh. Panic at the disco. Oh, no. No. Not like this. Not like this. Cargill, don't do anything stupid. Pickford. That's it. Oof. Got to win that Gallagher. Alexander-Arnold. On to Willock. Lovely ball over the top. Gallagher, can he finish first time? Oh, that's so unlucky. Looking for his first goal. Stunning pass. Didn't even see who did it. Bootful. Right. How have we only won this 2-1? <laughs> Six half chances, three clear-cut chances. I feel like we should have scored more. I don't think I'm being greedy when I feel like 23 shots, you may have should have scored more than two goals. That was a problem in, even in the game we lost and drew. We had the chances. We just weren't putting them away. Right, Hidara, there is no time. Just make sure you keep the ball. That will do. Rubbish. I'm going to say he got away with it. Oh. Bonus life. Fuck off. Wait, I scored two goals. I'm scoring for fun. Well, we should be scoring a hat trick before half time. Right, who have we got first in the Champions League? Mm -mm. Debut. We got fined. Yeah, could fine us, bitch. We got fucking sixty-four million pounds in the bank. Oh, better praise Boney M. Keep it up, mate. Keep it up. Right. <laughs> we're playing. <gasps> it's Dortmund, right? We're gonna skip the. I'm sorry. I know there's a ton of fans from Solihull Moors um, that are subscribed to the channel. Um, sorry, we are gonna skip that game in favour of. Dortmund, I hope you understand. Right, here we go. Um, we made short work of Solly Hull Moores, as expected. 5 1. We res rested Boney, but Danny has got a goal. Charlie Taylor with his first of the season, Magoma with a brace, and Sam Gallagher with the first of the season. He played a really good game, got man of the match. <coughs> Hello, voice. Hello. <coughs> um, he got man of the match, goal and an assist, played superbly well. Um, and uh, now we're going to get destroyed by Dortmund. Um, so we did rotate the team a little bit just to give a few players some restage. Um, we give Charlie Taylor a Hadara. Now he's got three and three. We'll go for the form man. Um, we'll go for Samfield, yeah. Um, I was going to say a bit more experienced because he's 19 instead of 18. Um, up front, obviously, Boney M. Um, right, score predictions then for this thing, this monster we're about to play. We're 50 to 1 to win the Champions League. Not even worth a pound on it, people. We're going to get eaten alive. Like, I've been raving about how good Boney's been, and he's been amazing, and he's like one of the best Premiership players and all that stuff. stuff. And then you kind of forget, and when you get to the Champions League, you're like, oh, yeah, that's what a good team looks like. Yeah, I forgot. Aubameyang, yeah, versus Harry Maguire. Oh, it's a clash of the Titans. 
Mm. Right, um, let's do this then. Oh shit, I meant to put counter-attacking on. We'll do that in a minute. Encourage everyone. Dear God. Dear God, just keep it sensible. Away against Dortmund. <coughs> Can I just watch the game like this? I just looking for my... Oh dear. I'm going to say... I can't see us even scoring a goal, to be honest. I'm going to say 4-0 to Dortmund, just in case you're wondering. 4-0 to Dortmund. I think if we can lose 2-0, that's a decent performance. <laughs> or, or, we go and score. Believe it, and it'll happen. Oh, it's a good tackle. But Hadara's got it back again. Near post. I thought that was going to be, thought that was going to be goal time. It's all right, we've still got it, though. We're giving him a game. Ten minutes gone. Headed away. Oh, here goes here goes the counter. Don't lunge. Don't lunge. Oh, Aubameyang's just taking the piss out of us. Oh. Andre Schürrler. Okay, we've cleared it away, but it's just coming straight back at us. <clears throat> Tete! Uh, Castro. Aubameyang. Oh, Jesus Christ. Get away. Okay. We survived 12 minutes. It's about expected. <laughs> it's not horrific. It was their first shot, to be fair. <sighs> Got to win that, boys. Got to win that. It's three of you there. Look at you. Having a cuddle. One shot, one got. Okay, they've had more shots now. Okay. Hang on, though. Hang on. Here we go. Goal time. Oh, bloody Berkey. Burkle. It's Burke. Just, you're just a Burke. Right, win the header. That's it, Fieldy. Lovely. Holding. Plays it forward to Boney. Loses the header, but it's going to come back. Getting the second balls. Boney. Danny Ings. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. If we lose it, it's like an instant goal for them. That's oh, lovely. Danny Ings. Danny Ings. Yes! Dings and get on there. Come on! And that old, what's his name? Tuchel dude that's Borussia Dortmund manager. He was giving it all that for the game. Saying that they're just going to wipe the floor with us. Seems a bit rude. It's unnecessary. It's true, but it's unnecessary. But we give him a little scare, if nothing else. Danny Ings, son, get in there. Oh, we might have just pissed him off. Oh, Pickford. Yes, loving it. Go on, Pickers. Pick and mix. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh, the wheel. It's the wheel. They've got the wheel. I forgot about that. <laughs> Not Magoma. Oh, no. Every time they've got it, I just feel, oh, Jesus. Oh, shut up. Don't let him cut inside. Don't let him shoot. Don't let him shoot. Oh, what a save, Pickford. Get in there. That's a worldie. As soon as he cut inside, I was worried. Dembele, back post. Pickford again. Come on, son. This is what we like to see. We're giving him a game. We're giving him a game. It's lovely. They've had not not had a single decent chance yet. I would argue some of their chances have been quite decent. Oh, mm, okay. Apparently, no clear cut chances and not a single half chance. I think the fact we're watching the game, we've seen at least a couple of half chances. That's why you can't always go by this. It's not the most accurate in the world. But we're hanging on. Get to half time, boys. Get to half times. Right, the wheel. To Tete. Then Bele. Then Bele. Abami and good tackle. <laughs> We're giving them a game. I'm loving this. Hadara. Dings. Boney. Oh, Magoma. Oh dear God. Oh dear God. 20 pace, 20 acceleration. <laughs> what a save, son. <laughs> I bet he's playing like a 6.9. 6.9, yeah? 6.9. They need to, please, Sports Interactive, please fix the goalkeeper ratings. And also the, like, ball-winning defensive midfielders, please. Because that's ridiculous. It, sh it should easily be a 7.5, I think. 6.8 now. Wow. I'm going to... Amazing. Yes! Come on, boys. Let's not... I was about to say, we might be able to nick a point. 
let's not get carried away here, people. Right, they know they've been in a game, though, right? Wow. I think the more pleasing thing is, we know that they're still going to probably beat us, probably 3-1 or something like that. But I think what pleases me is not so much, not just because we're giving them a game, it's that actually this tactic isn't that bad. Because not only are we a much worse team, we're also using this untried tactic. Hang on. Hang on. There's a bobble. Did you see it? Little turf popped up there. But, you know, this tactic is actually working. And it might work, you know, long term when the big boys arrive. Aubameyang turns his man. Yes! <laughs> the Bournemouth reject on Aubameyang. <laughs> Great tackle. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, they brought Goethe on. It's not a bad sub. <clears throat> Jesus. I was getting a bit warm, by the way, so we've gone, got rid of the hoodie. We're on to a bit of Deadpool action. What's this fucking chicken thing, Shirley? Dings is injured. Dings is down. He's he's died of embarrassment after missing that hit. Please, don't be mad. Oh, you don't need arms, for fuck's sake. They just get in the way, if anything. Just amputate it straight on the side of the pitch. Amputate, little plaster, bit of spray, magic sponge, send it back on. Right, come on, Brighty. 30 minutes left. Can we nick a goal? Do we go attacking? I feel like that would be suicide. So let's do it. Right, Hadara. <laughs> I love my logic sometimes. Right, here we go again. Boney. Onto field. Hadara plays it into Magoma. Back to Boney. Lovely. Bright. Has got an overlap. Glennie Johnson. Dinks it back post. Magoma. Oh, straight at the keeper. Oh, that was that, that was the goal, man. Three clear-cut chances. We're tearing them apart. They got lucky. We're going attacking. This seems crazy. Okay, this could be a counter-attack, though. Oh, oh, steady on. Steady on. <clears throat> got to win those headers. Oh, there's the ball back. Belotti, another half-decent player. Uh, Goethe, yeah, they're all right. You know, they're they're not a bad little team. I just want to point out, a lot of people said in the comments that <clears throat> we are now ground sharing with Reading and also three other teams. The pitch is just going to be mud, isn't it? Yes, Brighty, lovely stuff. Cuts inside, Boney, can he find his man? Cheeky, Magoma, yes! Come on! Come on, if we can get something out of this. Come on. You got this, boys. Magoma with a Champions League goal to go along with his golden boot last year. Still only valued at 600k. Bizarrely. Cheeky back heel. Lovely finish. It's 3 2. I'm so excited. My nose is running. Right, Sandfield needs to come off. Think of that. Going for a double central midfield. Unlucky Pickford. He's going to get a shit rating, isn't he? Six point six. Like, yeah, because you shouldn't lose rating for that, should you? Nobody in the world could have saved that unless he was really bad, so bad that you were standing in completely the wrong position and then just caught it. Ah, oh, four two looks. Don't score any more, because four two looks all right. Looks like we get five two starts to look a bit bit thrashy, doesn't it? A bit beating. All right, Magoma. Oh my god, Boney. Oh, now they're gonna go and fucking score again. No, they're not. Not today. Okay, maybe today. No, not today. I think he's on. I think he's on. I'm not sure if he's on. <laughs> <laughs> Get in! Ten for the season for Boney. Cheeky. Cheeky. Picks it up. 
One on one, just oh, leathers it, bottom corner. It's 4 3, my friends. I can't believe how well we've played again. Look, we look at the chances we've created as well. We're gonna we're, we're not gonna take anything from this game. Apart from pride. Unfortunately, pride is worth fuck all. But that was pretty damn good. Yeah, we can't fault the boys gave it. Well done. I'm oh, sorry. We can't fault the boys. After that, they gave it everything they had. My, my Australian's gone. It's gone. It's never there, but it's, it's, it's got worse. Um, oh, man. What a game. How long? How long for it? Is he broken his arm? Um, fractured. Oh, strap it up, bitch. Play through injury. We'll wear protective equipment for three to four weeks um, in light training and matches. Um, or... What? They're all the same fucking length. So, play. No, actually, I'm just... I Just get some rest, mate, yeah? We'll, you'll choose the option that doesn't cost us any money, but this is the exact same length. We're probably... The physio's not really there for a fractured arm, so I'll actually use the doctor as, as a more logical. And it makes me rotate the squad a bit as well. Goal and assist from Magoma. Well done, mate. Well done. Well done. Right. I feel like we got points from that. Unfortunately, we didn't. Um, I just want to show you one other thing before we end up here. Is I was talking about transfers, um, and, and I said that, uh, you know a lot of the sides are now spending money. They've realised that they they can spend money. Apart, to, psh, that it's gone away. It was there. It was gone away. How do I look at the previous window? Why is there no just like back button I never look at this shit I've got no idea transfers I don't want to see all the fucking transfers anyway Tranmere spent about 24 million or something like that Dagon and Redbridge have spent at least 15 million so there's teams spending money that's all I was trying to say right okay next episode I think we'll go on to do 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 We'll go on to Atletico Bilbao, and then we'll the, the Victoria game will show the second leg of that, the last group stage. Yes, yeah, so next episode is going to be an Atletico Bilbao, Notts County doubleheader. I'm pretty sure no one has ever said that sentence. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy it, please do leave a like. It helps a lot. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Also, go buy a brain sock. Daddy long legs. Don't like them. I will catch it. Hang on. Wait. I'm going to ninja catch this daddy long legs. That's just fucked off. Okay. That was a bit of a dip at the end of the episode there. Um, what can I do to make this end exciting? Hmm. Yeah, just leave it. It's gone now. It's gone.